Yeah, even I have completed my boards now, waiting for the result. Okay, fine. So you have completed the board. So 12. You have completed your 12. Yeah. Okay. Fine. Yeah. So, for today uh, we are going to have an introduction session on digital marketing. That uh, what you are going to learn in this course. Uh, uh, what are the things? Uh, uh, how digital marketing is going to help you, and uh, what are the career opportunities after completing digital marketing course. So that is what uh, we are going to see in this course. Okay, so uh, whenever uh, we will be having our session, this session will be recorded. Uh, so uh, whatever sessions we complete, uh, you can uh, come back and uh, revise your sessions. You can check the recordings anytime uh, in uh, by logging to this Facebook work, uh, workplace. So in Facebook workplace, uh, you can see the section over here post so under post i will be uploading all the content uh, so i'll be uploading all the videos over here so you will be able to see and uh, revise uh, every day's uh, uh, recordings that we have so that is what we are going to uh, do so now can you okay uh, can you see my uh, this powerpoint slide Yes, sir. Okay. Yes. So, uh, my name is Hitesh Chatralia. I am a corporate trainer and developer for content management system, digital marketing, and e commerce. Uh, I have trained more than uh, 30,000 students till now, and uh, I have trained uh, uh, clients like Accenture, TCS, Polaris, Seagate, Mahindra. Uh, then uh, Kotak, uh, I mean these are all my clients where I have taken trainings for digital marketing. Uh, then Volkswagen is my client, Vodafone is my client, uh, Telenor, uh, most of the companies. Then uh, uh, various business schools in Mumbai, various colleges in Mumbai and uh, of course various institutes in Mumbai and Navi Mumbai. Uh, I am based in Navi Mumbai, Khargar and uh, say i am associated with uh, walk in from uh, say more than one and a half to two years now uh, and uh, i am member of uh, indian institute of e-commerce and uh, also corporate trainers association mm -hmm. of india i am a certified trainer for digital marketing and google certified trainer level two and uh, i have received padma award from government of india in february 2019 so this is my small introduction wow. uh, and uh, yes i have uh, say around 11 years of experience in training and overall experience uh, of 20 years uh, before training uh, profession i was into say uh, working in an healthcare company it's a multinational company healthcare it uh, over there i have worked for uh, five years and then other companies it companies so overall experience I have of 20 plus years and uh, from past 11 years I am into training for digital marketing, content management systems and e-commerce. This is uh, just a small introduction about myself. So now to start with, we are starting with introduction to digital marketing. Now before I start uh, the introduction uh, today's session, I just want to tell you that uh, this session will be 100% practical training so practical in the sense that uh, i won't be showing you any slides in any of the sessions unless and until it is necessary otherwise i will take everything practically so that is what uh, the process would be so uh, say 80 percent of the training would be practical wherein i'll be showing you everything on my screen and uh, say only 20 percent would be theoretical like this uh, uh, presentation slides and everything that would be just 20 percent so this is how we'll be doing and uh, whatever we learned on a particular day, you will be practicing the same uh, on, uh, I'll be providing you where to practice. So for one week, you will be practicing till the time we have next session. In the next session, you will be noting down all the doubts that you have and we'll be resolving it. And then we'll be uh, taking further the next session. That is how the process uh, would continue. So today's session is just an introduction session so you don't need to worry about any homework for today 
uh, yes of course uh, you just need to pay attention to what uh, we are going to learn in this session so in this session what we are going to learn is what is digital marketing why do we use digital marketing what are the course features course content uh, then what are the digital marketing strategies who can do this course and career opportunities so these this uh, this all things will be seeing in this introduction session today now uh, can you just tell me what is digital marketing so marketing uh, marketing of products on digital platform marketing products on digital platform okay so marketing marketing products online on the way okay marketing products online yes that is also a very good uh, answer so basically digital marketing is promoting or creating brand awareness using internet so anything that we do to promote our uh, products or services or just create brand awareness about our company using internet is called as digital marketing so that is everything is done online through internet now if we want to do digital marketing online uh, through internet then we require some uh, digital marketing mediums through which we can promote right so the first thing over here is search engines so search engine plays a very important role in digital marketing uh, because uh, if i give you one example that if you just want to search anything on uh, the uh, internet the first thing that comes to your mind is google so we will be searching anything on google and google will provide you with all the list of websites uh, coming up uh, in a particular order and uh, then you you will click on any of the results that you like and uh, you will uh, see the information you know, provided now my first question is uh, whenever you search in any search engine Uh, how does all the results which are there in search engine come up say like uh, if i open uh, google.com and uh, i search for digital marketing and press enter then you will see various websites now how does uh, these all websites come into uh, google did google come and ask me that uh, whether you have a website or did uh, all the people go to google and say that i we want to add our website to google so how does all, how did all these websites uh, come into google uh, can uh, can you just uh, guess they they register the domain name okay so okay fine uh, i register a domain name okay fine i purchase a domain name from big rock okay that's fine then after that uh they register with google and uh, google according to the traffic according to the people who visit the website they put the rank of the website so mm, okay uh, is this just uh, what you think or you have read it somewhere no i think okay fine so i'll i'll tell you say this is not the case i mean uh, say registering a domain that is a different thing now say you have a website uh, it does not depend on the traffic uh, that your website receives or uh, i do not go and register on uh, google the whole process is automatic see if i drive if i want to drive a vehicle first of all i need to know how to drive the vehicle after that only i can drive it right so first i need to learn it the same way if i want to get my website or uh, youtube videos or my blog or any content uh, in uh, search engine results then first of all i need to know how does a search engine work see there are various aspects of uh, search engine uh say like uh, the first thing uh, is crawling uh, so what does google do google have small application programs called as google bots so these google bots uh, will go around the internet uh, and crawl all the new websites which are uploaded today so it will not just collect uh, websites it will collect everything 
you see all the content like text images videos uh, blogs everything whatever you have uploaded uh, it will uh, capture that and it will uh, take it to the google server and then it is stored but now what type of content will it uh, capture so what type of content does it uh, crawl so it will crawl only unique content unique content in the sense that uh, if i have copied the content from here and there and added to my website then it will not take that content then it will uh, just uh, check the database of google and say that okay this website has copied content from all these websites uh, so i will not take the content of this website so this website will never come up in search engine so that is how the website is collected by google search box now if my content is original then uh, again the google bots will come to my website they will uh, capture the content they will check it with the google database and say that okay yes uh, this content is not available anywhere else this is original content so it will uh, take the data with it now after taking the data what is the next step next step is indexing indexing is a process where it will arrange all the websites in a particular order with which uh, it matches with the keywords that people are searching on uh, google so say suppose i am searching for digital marketing and the content which is very much relevant to me and the quality of the content is very much uh, nearer to a particular website then that website will come up at the first position then second position then third position then fifth position like that millions of websites are arranged in a particular order uh, with a particular term called as digital marketing or any other term that we are searching so this is how it is indexed and then it is processed and then it is stored in the database now where is it stored so it can get stored in any anywhere so google is having their servers worldwide and uh, most of the countries they have their uh, servers and uh, it is stored but uh, when i search for a particular content then at that point of time your browser will ask you for your location it will ask you for allow location right so now uh, why does uh, any browser uh, ask you to allow your location that is because uh, say whenever you are searching anything on uh, google say like uh, restaurants near me so in that case it will show all the restaurants uh, near your area and not the restaurants which are uh, in us uk europe anywhere else because if i want to have lunch or dinner i am not going to go to us or uk just for having lunch i'll go to the nearby places which are just a few minutes away so for that reason google will ask you for your location so that it can give you the right uh, results when you are searching for any query on google so this is how search engine works so this is the first uh, important part so in this search engines uh, we will be learning search engine optimization in search engine optimization we will learn how to optimize a content so that it will come up on the first page of google there are various parameters for this so we will be seeing what are the different parameters with which uh, we can uh, get our content in search engines so that is all search engine optimization and uh, i would just like to uh, tell you that search engine optimization is the most important uh, uh, module of uh, digital marketing uh, because it is you it will be used overall from the first module to the last module that we are going to learn in digital marketing uh i would suggest you to uh, mute your microphone because uh, there is a lot of disturbance that is coming up uh, and it will uh, also come up in the recordings so only when you have questions i would suggest you to unmute your microphone whenever i ask you at that point of time only you can unmute your microphone and you can uh, talk thank you so we'll continue now after search engines uh, we have websites so uh, in websites there are various things that we need to consider so we will be just seeing uh, that what are the things uh, that we can implement 
in a website uh, related to search engine optimization so search engine optimization and websites both are linked together uh, website is just because uh, we should know that uh, if we are talking about any website say if uh, after becoming a digital marketing uh, marketer and uh, you open your own digital marketing agency and uh, if someone says that I want to optimize web my website uh, so that it comes up in search engine so first of all you need to study their website and see what are the aspects uh, what is the content in the website what are the changes that you can do so that all things will be doing a lot of research work in websites and uh, make sure that how does the content come up in uh, search engines now uh, that is how uh, we will be looking at websites now website is also important because it is the face of the company uh, because uh, if any visitor is searching for anything the website name would come up website link would come up where people can click and browse their website about uh, what are the products and services they have to offer now uh, if I say that uh, the company does not have a website or uh, the website is very poor and uh, it does not have much content then uh, there are various things that we need to take care and uh, there are various things that we need to add in the website so those all things we'll be seeing in the website uh, and then we'll be optimizing it for getting it into search engine so basically optimizing the website for search engines so that whole process is called as search engine optimization so that can be not just for websites it can be for anything like social media or your youtube account or uh, say twitter or linkedin anything uh, so that applies everywhere so that is the reason i said that uh, search engine optimization the first module is the most important module so uh, we need you it's like foundation of the course you need to know it very well so the next thing is social media See nowadays everybody is there on social media so people are using Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn or say Facebook and Instagram uh, people are using, people are using YouTube uh, nowadays people have also started to use these all hello app and TikTok and God knows what not there are various things that people are using of course but I don't say that uh, uh, something is bad or something is good or something is like that it's not that every every uh, website has their own uh, pros and cons uh, that we need to know so in social media we will be studying Facebook uh, for a professional network like uh, how to create a Facebook uh, presence for a company to create a Facebook presence of a company we need to have a Facebook page so we will be creating a Facebook page optimizing it adding all the content to it and then uh, promoting it through Facebook ads so we will be learning uh, various uh, advertising content also uh, how to advertise on Facebook uh, what type of advertisements are available what type of lead generations then we can we do uh, how can we get more business by advertising on Facebook where can we advertise on Facebook so these all things will be learning in Facebook now similar to Facebook we have Google as well Google AdWords so we can place various Google ads you must have seen uh, various uh, advertisements on various websites say like in terms of banners or say videos or something like that uh, say banners on the right hand side or in between the content or coming up on the content say left hand side on the top banner top header you will see sometimes at the bottom of the website you might see some images uh, which are advertisements so those all are mm, those all ads are placed by Google so we will be learning how to place ads on various places you know, on the internet uh, then you must have seen ads in mobile devices also uh, say like uh, place uh, there might be a banner at the bottom of the screen or full screen ad is coming up a full screen video is coming up so these are all ads then after the video plays for certain seconds then you will see a cross button then you can uh, close the ad and uh, continue with your work then in YouTube also you see skippable and non skippable ads so those all ads how to place those all ads we will be seeing so those ads can be placed with the help of Google AdWords so we will be seeing practically how to place ads 
uh, on YouTube, uh, Facebook and uh, various websites and mobile devices also. So that all things will be seen in uh, social media. Then apart from that, uh, we will be seeing how to create a YouTube channel. Uh, then uh, in YouTube channel, we will be seeing uh, how to optimize your YouTube channel and then uploading a video in YouTube and uh, making sure that uh, that particular video comes up on the first page of uh, Google and YouTube. So that is the most important. So there is a myth that uh, if your video is having a very large amount of views or uh, a huge subscriber base then and only then your video comes up to the first page of results no it is not like that i will show you my uh, video i'll just show you my channel and i will search for uh, uh, my uh, video with one of the keywords and then i'll show you where is my video where does it rank so i'll just uh, open uh, youtube.com And uh, now I will just search for my keyword. Okay, it's opening up. So over here I need to search. Okay. 21 days. days unlocking series so I'll just press enter and see so over here you can see uh, the uh, my video is at the first position uh, over here you can see my name also Hitesh Chatralia so 21 days unlock uh, lockdown series so unlocking digital marketing by Hitesh Chatralia so over here my video is on the first page now if you see my video is having only 1100 views it is two months old and I have only 27 subscribers. So I mean it doesn't have uh, thousands or millions of views uh, and it does not have uh, thousands or lakhs of subscribers. Now if I scroll down you can see this is a verified channel. Say it is having 3.1 million views and uh, still this is coming at the third position and my video is at the first position. So if anyone says that uh, you require millions of views and millions of subscribers to be on the top, then that is false. I have only 1100 views and only 27 subscribers, but still my video is on the top, right? Now if you search for the same thing on Google, on Google also I will search for the same keyword, 21 days unlocking series. See, you can see my video at the first position over here. So this is what uh, we need to do. So it is just optimizing. That is, uh, we have to use search engine optimization uh, everywhere. So whether it is uh, for website or YouTube channel or your Facebook account or your Twitter account or your LinkedIn account. Everywhere you need to do search engine optimization so that you can get your content to the first page. So that is what we will be seeing in uh, this uh, so social media. So in social media, I will be uploading a video in front of you and uh, I will make sure that that video comes up in the on the first page. So that is all we will be seeing in social media. Now apart from uh, you know, Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, uh, Instagram and uh, YouTube, this is all what we know in India that people are using and now nowadays people know about WhatsApp, TikTok and uh, Hello app and something like that. But now, now there are n number of uh, other social media networks uh, that is uh, you know, say top 50 social media networks, top 100 social media networks which uh, you can use uh, so that you can get your content to the, you can promote your content worldwide. So we will be seeing what are the other social media networks so that you can reach to the top. So that is we will be seeing. Uh, then uh, we will be seeing uh, uh, mobile app marketing. So mobile app marketing is something wherein uh, uh, we will be seeing how to promote the content through mobile apps. 
so through mobile apps uh, you can promote your content uh, just one second okay so uh, through mobile apps uh, you can uh, you can see uh, you can promote uh, various uh, apps you can put uh, say your ads to on all the mobile devices in a particular location so if you say that you want your ads uh, to come up in mumbai or navi mumbai or uh, say whole india or australia or us uk or any city particular city of a particular country you can promote your uh, ads uh through mobile devices uh, nowadays mobile device mobile uh, is very important uh, because everybody is using a mobile device it is not necessary that people might have a laptop or desktop at their house but uh, people will definitely have a mobile device uh, in their house so uh, mobile marketing is very important which we will see uh, what are the various things that we can do through mobile marketing and uh, in this uh, uh, digital marketing lecture i will also be teaching you how to create your own android app so if you are interested to learn how to create your own android app i will also teach you that uh, part and it is very easy and you do not require any programming knowledge so that you can create your and have your own mobile app so so this so yes tell me so so this app so Sorry. So, so this app will not be uh, available on App Store or uh, available on Apple Store. If you the the app which you are which you are going to teach us. Yeah. Hello. Yeah. yeah. Will will not be able to see Apple Store. So I mean, say if you want to use it, you want to upload it on uh, App Store, then uh, you need to have membership of Apple, and uh, you need to purchase. That is ninety nine dollars. You have to pay for it. and uh, that is uh, yearly 99 dollars so unless and until you are doing it uh, professionally i would not suggest you to upload it on uh, say uh, app store because if you are using ios then in that case it is very costly uh, you have to pay uh, app app store 99 dollars every year as a developer account you need to have a developer account but uh, if you have android device then it's very easy, cheap uh, i mean it's very cost effective uh, you just need to pay 25 dollars to google and uh, that is lifelong every year you do not require to re renew your membership and uh, you can upload your uh, app on uh, play store also so and you can share it with your friends so uh, that is the reason i would uh, be using an android app not an ios app because uh, ios is not free it, uh, it cannot be uh, uh, learnt free of cost it requires various uh, i mean uh, softwares for developing it of course android also uses uh, you can create it but uh, yes i mean uh, some of the websites will also provide you ios app for for free so at that point of time we will see all the options that are available for ios as well as android so don't worry about it but uh, yes you can distribute your app on your blog also people can come to your blog and download the app so that is not a problem that it it should be available in app store only uh, then and only then uh, people can download it it's not necessary or else you can even uh, share them uh, your app so that Yeah. So, so the same function is used for both Apple and Android app. I mean, for if you upload a uh, uh, app on Android, so the same function is used to upload on Apple Store or just other some other thing. Yeah, it's the same process. But the only thing is that uh, in both the places you require a developer account, and uh, in uh, Apple the developer account is very costly. Uh, every year you have to renew it with ninety nine dollars. But in Android, uh, okay. becoming a developer is very easy. You just need to pay twenty five dollars, which is very cost effective, and that is for lifelong. But that is not uh, you do not require to renew it uh, again and again. So even if you have hundred hundreds of apps you create, then you can upload it in your uh, Play Store account. So that is the reason Android is very cost effective. So okay, I mean, sir. And, uh, there so are so Android. 
So, so does Android pay us when our app become famous? Do they pay us? Uh, yes, there are various criteria. From day one, you can start making money on Android. So I'll be teaching you all those uh, things. Also, it's not just uh, Android uh, with which you can make money. It's uh, say each and every module, right from the first module to the last module that we'll be learning. Uh, there is revenue in it, and uh, I'll be showing you how to generate this kind of revenues with the help of digital marketing uh, platforms. So every module has okay, revenues in it. So, uh, so, sir, you will help us out, right? Yes, yes, absolutely. I will guide you. So, that all things are okay, sir. Thank you. Yeah. Then uh, we have. Yeah, sir. sir, is yeah. sir, is there a search engine optimization for uh, Android apps or uh, App Store apps? Absolutely. So, when we talk about search engine optimization, it is not just for. Uh, in, uh, websites or blogs or uh, YouTube uh, videos. It is also for uh, uh, Play Store and App Store also. So I will be. I have a developer uh, login for uh, Android. Uh, so I'll be logging into my Android uh, uh, developer account and I'll be showing you how to optimize the content. So I mean, if you know how to optimize, then it's very easy for you to uh, optimize any content in the world. So, the process remains the same. Once you know how to do the research, then that research you will you can apply it everywhere. Whether it's a website or Facebook, uh, you know, Facebook page or your uh, Twitter account or your LinkedIn account or your YouTube videos or any other social media account. If once you get to know how to do the research and implement it, then that's it. Then you will be you can uh, implement it everywhere. So that is all in mobile apps marketing so then we have email marketing uh, in email marketing say uh, we will be sending uh, uh, various uh, emails uh, uh, please uh, mute your microphone okay so uh, in email marketing we will be seeing uh, how to promote our business with the help of email marketing and uh, we can send a uh, lots of emails say like you have a subscriber base of uh, 1000 or 5000 or 10000 or even millions of uh, subscribers you have on your website and now you want to send them some offers uh, to your subscribers so now i cannot send uh, my uh, emails with the help of uh, gmail or uh, i cannot log into my server and send an email with my official email address I mean, of course, I will be using my official email address, but uh, I cannot uh, send it with my server or Gmail uh, server. I have to use uh, particular uh, applications or service providers through which I can send uh, bulk emails uh, professionally. So, yes, there are various uh, places, various service providers for sending bulk emails. Uh, so, we will be uh, exploring all those uh, applications uh, and see how to practically create templates and uh, send beautifully created templates uh, emails to all our subscribers so that is what we'll be learning in email marketing and then inbound marketing so inbound marketing is uh, nothing as such uh, say a particular module but it is just a strategy that we need to implement everywhere so say like uh, from search engine market search engines to websites social media mobile marketing email marketing in all these marketing we are pushing our content to customers say like we are trying to promote something so in inbound marketing also of course we are promoting but we are promoting it with some concept so concept like uh, say i might uh, just say that uh, by implementing our strategies you can gain 20 percent return on investment so I mean even if a person is earning um, 5 crores or 10 crores say 20 percent is a very big amount for them also so they will at least come to us and ask that okay what is, what is this and uh, how can we uh, get started with this and uh, how soon can we uh, get the results with this in with this with the uh, strategy that you are offering so in this case what we will be getting is leads 
so we will be getting more leads for our business so that is inbound marketing where people will come to us and ask that okay fine we require your services instead of we promoting our content uh, and pushing our content to people so inbound marketing is a very good strategy that you can use everywhere on your websites or social media or mobile apps everywhere even in email marketing also you can use it so it helps a lot and apart from that uh, we have one more module uh, which is called as affiliate marketing uh, nowadays affiliate marketing is coming up in a very big way wherein uh, people can make a uh, lots of money and uh, a lots of uh, revenues can be generated with the help of affiliate marketing now affiliate marketing is something wherein uh, you will be selling other people's product uh, and making money say like amazon amazon is offering uh, affiliate program you can just open amazon.in and you will scroll down to the footer and you will see a link called as become an affiliate so you can uh, say i'll just show you over here uh, i'll open uh, amazon and uh, i'll just show you okay so amazon is open so i just scroll down to the bottom of the screen and over here you can see become an affiliate this is the link so i click on this link become an affiliate and i can uh, join this program over here with this button and i can start selling all the 10 crore products that are available on amazon now over here at the bottom you can see how much you will be earning see you will earn four percent on electronic wireless then twelve percent on fashion shoes jewelry ten percent on health and beauty uh, then ten percent on home kitchen gourmet specialty products then uh, ten percent on kids and baby toys six percent on music and movies ten percent on sports outdoors hobbies twelve percent on office and stationeries and uh, there are various other things i mean there are all the things where you can sell say 10 percent on books and magazines so uh, you can sell all these uh, all these 10 crore products on your website or a blog if you do not have a website then uh, you can uh, create a blog and you can uh, promote your blog you can add these products so whenever people will visit your blog or website and click on these uh, links your affiliate links uh, people will go to amazon and uh, whenever they purchase uh, those products or any products from uh, Amazon you will be earning that amount so I mean th that is very good I mean sitting doing nothing I mean just promoting their uh, products and you make money so like Amazon there are various other uh, programs that are available in India as well as worldwide uh, wherein you can earn in Indian rupees as well as in dollars so yes uh, these affiliate programs are really very good option uh, so i mean uh, more and more people are joining affiliate programs worldwide and uh, they are making huge amount of money with uh, affiliate uh, marketing so we will see in detail how to um, uh, implement this affiliate marketing uh, on our website and uh, how you can uh, take up and research for different affiliate marketing what are the different programs they are offering so now like amazon is offering pay per sale so if you sell something you get paid now there are other uh, programs also which are called as pay per lead so pay per lead is when people will come to your website click a link and uh, they'll go to some website and there they'll just fill up some details say details like name mobile number email address uh, that's it and city and country so that uh, details are filled and they submit that detail uh, you will get uh, say around one dollars two dollars maybe five dollars sometimes uh, 50 cents like that uh, you can make so i mean in uh, even if you just uh, uh, say provide 100 leads or uh, maybe even just 10 leads so i mean at the end of the day you are making 10 dollars so that's not a bad uh, amount I mean, ten dollars is say seven sixty rupees uh, in today's date. So I mean, yes, uh, that's a very good program. So affiliate marketing is there. So apart from uh, all these uh, modules, we will also be seeing various tools uh, in uh, digital marketing. That what are the various tools available and how to use those tools. 
uh, in different uh, way and uh, how to um, uh, get more out of it uh, and use it in various modules of digital marketing so that it will make our life easier so for that tools are made so this is all uh, we'll be learning in digital marketing so if you have any questions you can ask me about this course so i mean uh, just don't see that we are going to learn only this much what is seen on this particular screen no there is a lot of things which is there in inside each and everything say like search engine is one of the biggest module then website is a big module social media is a very big module mobile marketing is a big module then uh, email and sms marketing is big module so like i mean there are various things uh, that are going to come up so this course is not going to complete in a week or 15 days it will at least take you one and a half month to complete this course so that is what uh, we will be so sir now. yeah so sir so, so, our classes matlab uh, our daily classes will be online or will be come will be call will be held taking our classes at channel road also sir no no this all classes will be online uh, so that is already conveyed to the uh, journey road uh, institute so this will be online okay sir yeah so okay and, so uh, if we, yeah tell me if you need any help like if you have any doubt and we need more practice so then who will help us out sir of course i'll be helping you uh, so for that reason uh, that uh, group is whatsapp group is created so in that whatsapp group you can ask me any questions any doubts you have you can ask me any uh, if i am not online i so, sir, whenever i check the messages i'll reply back yes tell me so sir, uh, uh, what are we matlab if you are working on digital marketing like on a laptop so sir if you are matlab um, if i want to show matlab ki maine aisa kiya hai so how will i show uh in that case uh, say if you have if you have done anything you can send me the screenshots of uh, the screens that you want to show me uh you have the options okay. over here say this is our uh, workplace this is say walking journey road you can see over here uh, you can just click yes, on sir. this post so in post you can upload all the screenshot and ask me this is our official uh, place where we can communicate and uh, for messages and everything okay, that, uh, so sir so there will be no one else so there will be no one else watching this or so it's only 3 no, or 4 of us only we three are there currently i'll add the owner also the okay. rishabh jain also i'll add him so uh, you okay. can also see see it so apart from okay. uh, we four we cannot see uh, anybody else cannot see because this is a closed group you you can already see it on the top it's a uh, walking journey road official group and clo it is a closed group so only the members of it can see the content uh, inside it so okay sir uh, so that is not a problem so it's hundred uh, percent private yeah. yeah sir so you can uh, okay, post all the content your queries everything over here and uh, if it is urgent you can uh, post it uh, on uh, you can post it uh, on mm. whatsapp also that uh, i have sent uh, screenshots and all those things uh, over there so, i mean if it is urgent i mean you can even send the screenshot on whatsapp group also that is also not a problem so uh, of course uh, that is uh, also a better option so i mean whatever is convenient to you you can use it so you can post it over here also and uh, you can uh, post it on whatsapp group also so whatsapp group already the admin is there uh, so that is not a problem so you can post it over there uh, now uh, say uh, in this post Uh, today's recording will be uploaded in this post so whatever recordings we have so like whatever we have learned today uh, today's introduction session from the time we started this session uh, this session is being recorded currently and uh, once it is uh, processed in within 2 hours it will be uploaded in this place so at any point in the afternoon or evening time you can come and watch the same session again so that so that uh, okay. you will you can revise it you will get to know that okay fine what is this digital marketing all about uh, right from the first lecture to the last lecture all the lectures would be recorded and it will be posted in this group over here so i mean uh, apart from uh, you know, what we are learning live so, in this session so those uh, sessions will be uploaded over here also so in case if you want to revise 
uh, you can again come to this place with the date and time uh, with the date and the name of the session i will be uh, uploading the lectures over here so you will you won't face any problems for uh, finding any particular lecture so sir uh, after course get over and when we are actually working and we need help so sir this video will be there for life long or the courses over the video will also go i mean at least for a, i mean at least for a year it will be available okay. Okay. so we can record in our computer also because after a year it will go no it will delete right no no we won't be deleting it uh, this will remain over here uh, lifelong as such i mean see uh, we won't be uh, deleting it so i mean it will be over here itself so i mean this uh, and these videos cannot be deleted uh, and uh, downloaded i mean delete i i can delete it but it cannot be downloaded so you can go and watch over here at any point of time so that is not a problem so that's right yeah <coughs> hello yeah hello so after we complete the course and what after we complete the course and what should we do so after you complete the course uh, you uh, you will be provided with uh, assignments that you need to complete and uh, once the assignments are completed you need to submit those assignments Uh, to the institute after which uh, you will be getting your certificates apart from that i will also be uh, showing you uh, how you can get uh, uh, google certification so that is international certification you can apply for uh, so you will get a certificate in digital marketing uh, from yeah. google also yeah. so that all options are okay. available yeah. so there also you can watch yeah. the videos and uh, you can learn everything yeah. and uh, after each and every uh, video you have some questions if you go through all the uh answers correctly uh, to all the questions then you can still uh, go to the next uh, video and then after completing all of them uh, you will get the certification uh, certification from google uh, that is on digital marketing so you will be certified from google also so that is international certification that you will be getting so i'll train you for that also okay. i mean this is something extra this is not included in this course but i will be giving it to you So that is what uh, okay. providing. Okay, thank you. So this is online lecture because of uh, COVID, or you would, uh, or you or else you would take normally also online, or you would have come see, to Chennai uh, to teach us. Normally, see, I used to travel uh, in various journey roads which are near to my area. See, coming to Chennai road, I had already uh, even when uh, last year also when I was taking lectures in various walking institutes, I told them that Chennai road is very far. and it's not uh, direct uh, trains and direct buses are not available so i won't be traveling to journey road so henceforth all the lectures uh, from journey road for all the students and coming batches also i will be taking it online see there are various walking institutes where i cannot travel see dombivali and kalyan that is also very far to uh, from here so it's not convenient see if you uh, tell that okay you uh, travel to andheri dadar i mean i have direct trains from here you so to travel to andheri i have a direct train from khargal uh, then uh, traveling to dadar i have a direct bus from my house so it's uh, that is very convenient see that saves me time Uh, for that reason uh, yeah, yeah. i won't be traveling to chennai road and the places uh, which are inconvenient to me and which takes more than 2 hours to travel so i mean that is uh, say not feasible in that 2 hours i can take one another lecture so that is only thing yes, so yeah. that is the reason but uh, you don't worry, you, you can give me a call anytime you have my number in case uh, say if i don't pick up your call uh, you can just leave a message on whatsapp uh, so that's not a problem whenever i check the messages i'll get back to you or i'll give a call back or else you can say that uh, i need to talk to you i'll give a call back whenever you require so i mean that's uh, not a problem at all and of course uh, Uh, we will meet once so don't worry i we will meet personally whenever i have time i will visit chennai road we can fix up an appointment and uh, you can clear all the doubts so that is not a problem so at least traveling once or twice it's not a problem for me so but uh, not in okay, uh, later on uh, say once we complete it we'll we'll definitely meet don't worry yeah, yeah sir thank you sir thank you. Huh. and you will receive all the support from and for yeah tell me 
no, 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 you will continue. Yeah. I'll just send no, later. I mean, I was just saying that you will get all the support from me anytime. So whenever you have anything, you can directly just leave a message and I'll get back to you. That's it. Yeah. Uh, uh, okay. Okay. Uh, and for today, what should we learn? Today, it's uh, just say, today was just introduction that what are the things that you are going to learn in digital marketing and uh, what would be the process of this uh, uh, course that uh, say whenever we'll be learning that would be say uh, everything would be practical. So from next batch onwards, we will be having a practical thing. We will be starting our first module that is search engine optimization. So that would be hundred percent practical. So over there we won't be having any slides. So I will be opening a website. I will be adding a blog to it, and then I will be starting uh, how to do search engine optimization into it. What are the search engine parameters into it? What are the things that we need to know in search engines? That all things we'll be learning in next uh, session. So that is the thing that you will uh, need to learn everything. Uh, so I will be sharing you the slides for search engine optimization. Also, say for uh, most of the modules, uh, I have prepared the slides uh, which you can refer as notes, uh, and uh, it has most of the information. So all theoretical information is already so, covered. Sir? Yes. So sir, when you are doing, when you are uh, when when we are learning, so can we do the same thing simultaneously? Uh, yes, you can do it. Uh, that is not a problem. Uh, this is just to save time. Uh, I would be teaching you, and uh, you will have at least uh, say a week's time to do it. Uh, see, uh, we say currently for first two weeks, we will be having. Uh, uh, only uh, one lecture a week, but uh, I am completing one of the batch uh, from the other. So we will be having then I will be having uh, two days a week. So then you will have two days a week, okay. and then you will be learning more, and uh, then you will have more things to practice. Okay, okay sir. Yeah. So gradually, yeah, yes, uh, you can practice. That is not a problem. But uh, say, I mean, uh, online, uh, if you do anything, and if I'm not able to see your screen, then uh, that is yeah. it's a waste of time. So if we are doing it personally, I'm visiting the institute. Uh, then it's okay. Then uh, I I can see your screens. What you are doing. This is not the normal procedure that we follow for all the institutes. That you will be doing everything in front of me. So yes, over here. Also, some of the parts you will be doing it in front of me, and uh, some of them you will be. So, sir, we'll board. be sharing screen, right? Yeah, yeah, my screen would be shared. So today, you you saw my slides, you saw all the slides. Yeah, today. yeah. The same way you will be seeing my screen. That okay, fine. I'm opening a website. I'm doing something. I'm logging in somewhere. I'm adding some uh, content. I'm okay, doing sir. some researching, doing keyword research. Everything you will see my screen. So. That everything okay. you will be able to see, so that's not a problem at all. And uh, yeah, sir, of course, uh, that session will also be recorded, so you can see that video any number of times. So that is not a problem again. Yeah, yeah sir. Thank you, sir. Okay. Oh, okay. okay. See you. Yeah, okay. sir. Thank you. Okay. See you. Thank you so much. Thank you. So I'll let you know when we have a next session. So next Monday definitely we'll have the session. So I'll keep you updated. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Bye. Th thank you so much. Bye. 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 Bye.